Hello everyone, this is Gamer, and welcome back to Alcamilla. Let's continue where we last left off, shall we? Here we are. And I'm loving this music, too. Well, if there's nothing else we can do here, except get the heck out of this mall, it's time to get out of here. Indeed. There's nothing else we need in this mall. All right. Um, I bet you if I try to go back instead, there's no point going back. Oh. Oh, the music changed though. Interesting. Okay. Very interesting. Well, we're back to here. So, uh, where do I go? I mean, I remember playing this, but I don't remember the whole game, so I'm probably don't remember this half. So, yeah. Is this the right way? Honestly, I don't know. Was that cop car? Was that cop car there? I don't think so. Can't be open. Yep. It's all boarded up. Hmm. Yeah, this is new. I haven't been this way. Yeah, no way to cross that. I forgot something. Something important. What did you forget? What did you forget that's so important? Yep, locked. Hmm. Dead body. A Half-Life 2 dead body. Bay. <laughs> Is this my place? No, it's all boarded up, so it can't be my place. Okay, this has got to be my place. Good lord, that's a lot. Ah, uh, it's good to be back home. Calming music, too. Hmm, got nothing to say about the TV, huh? Interesting. Oh, this door was never opened before. Interesting. Oh, there's alcohol. Door is stuck. There's not even a door handle. Lock is broken. Door is stuck. How is your front door stuck? Was that photo frame down before? Door is stuck. Oh, we can't go in the bathroom no more? Interesting. So should we just go back to our uh, my room? I guess so. What the? Whoa, why is there blood in the kitchen? Why are there bodies buried in my backyard? My god. What the hell happened here? You should know. This is your own damn house. Uh. 
Uh, those flowers were not on the floor before. I mean, those leaves were not on the floor before. Neither were these leaves. All these leaves are falling apart. Something's not right. Door is stuck. Everything's a little too quiet now. Door is stuck. Hmm. I picked up a shovel. Dig up the backyard because in our in our dream or something we saw some dead bodies back here. Oh my god. But they they died in the accident. Why are they here? What's going on? Back in the fence in the background is glitching out or freaking out. And there goes the sirens. Bruh, you murdered your family. What is this? No. No, it can't be. It's Kaufman's fault. I'm going to find him and I'm going to kill him. I don't think it's his fault. I think you did something wrong, mister. Me meaning me as a character. Bruh. This is literally hell. Oh my god. My house is all jacked up. Look at this. This is, If this is not a telltale sign that I murdered someone, I don't know what is. Look at this. Door is stuck. Can't go upstairs. Lovely. Fantastic. Lock is broken. This nightmare again. Yeah. Welcome to the nightmares, man. Welcome to the nightmares. Oh. Oh, great. My bathroom looks all jacked up. Yay. This is my front door. Great. Look at this. Man, my house is big. Wow. But that's not important. What's important is we got all this metalish hell. Look at this. The music is intense here. But I love it. This music suits this environment so well. Oh, can't go to reach that door because, yeah, there's a missing floor. Look at this environment. It looks so messed up, but I love it. But this door, nothing, of course. Look at that dangerous behind windmill, Jesus Christ. I love how open this is. This is so open. All the way across is from here. Look at that fan, man. I mean, look at that windmill. So evil. This one's even closer than the other one. <coughs> Excuse me. How does these? So it looks like we're going to the police station, huh? Interesting choice to go. Especially in this situation. Should have went to the police station in the fog world, Dove here. Don't know why. Oh crap. 
Hold on, give me one moment. My phone's about to die. I need to charge my phone because I have a timer on my phone so it tells me how long I've been recording. Ha! Huh. Let's go through this door. Lock is broken. I can't open this door. Lovely. Duck. Interesting. Lock is broken. Lock is broken. Is there a save point here? There's gotta be a save point. There's no save point? Really? Let me check. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I can already tell that this is going to be bad right here. I can already tell. Hold on, let me wipe my hands because I'm, I'm sweating a little bit. I don't know why. This is making me nervous. Ew, look at this floor. It's all bushy and gutty and ugh. It's like a flesh wall. Oh no! Oh god, the fire! Hurry! Are you serious? I went the wrong way. I'm dead. There we go. Stupid me went the wrong way. I know where to go now. Ah! Just follow the mouse. Oh my god, this fire is spreading quick. Oh shit. Wrong way. This way. I got stuck. That was so unfair. I'm trying to make it to the other side. No, I'm dying! Ooh. Ooh. Okay. That was cool. I like how I walked through fire on that moment. That was cool. Oh, of course, we're back at Alcamilla Hospital. What a coincidence. What a freaking... Wait, what? What? We're back in the fog world? But there wasn't even no sirens. What the hell? Okay, now I'm actually thrown off and weirded out now. Because usually the sirens would be an indicator to change to the next world. Okay, I'm a little bit freaked out now. Locked. Door is stuck. Alright, let me save. I have a feeling that these circles are connected to me. They probably are. Hmm. Door stuck, of course. Locked. Lock is broken. Locked. Door stuck. Locked. Door stuck. Locked. Elevator doesn't have any power. This door doesn't have a handle, so we got no choice but to go to the basement. Whoa. I don't remember the basement being like this before. This the door. This totally reminds me of that going down the stairwell on Silent Hill 2, which felt like forever to go down, but it finally reached the end. 
Ugh, such long stairs, man. When, uh, when James from Silent Hill 2 had to go all the way down the stairs just to reach the, um, prison under Silent Hill, which I don't even know how there's a prison under Silent Hill. That was weird. Alright, this little tiny room. This is probably gonna be my revelation room, I bet. It's a little diary. Ask the doctor to let me quit being in charge of that patient. It's too weird. He's still alive, but with wounds that look that won't heal. Told the doctor I quit. Won't work at that hospital anymore. The room is filled with insects. Even with the doors and windows shut, they get in to spite me. To the hospital feeling bad. Need to throw up. But nothing comes out. Vomiting only bile. Blood and pus flow from the bathroom faucet. I try to stop it, but it won't turn off. Need drug. Help me. Oh, is that that journal from Silent Hill 1 with Lisa? Yeah, with Nurse Lisa? Yeah, alright, let's check this out. In addition to the ritual, I decided that White Claudia might be suited to recreational use. Using my contacts in the cult as the advantage, I began to successfully sell PTV using an antique shop as my cover. My position as hospital director gives me great a access to the necessary equipment for the production of the drugs. And I am, I, I, and I'm able to safely store them in a secret part of the hospital. The harm that drugs do makes me sick, but no one is forcing these stupid tourists to buy it. That idiot nurse Lisa will do whatever I tell her for her, her dose. Damn. Another funny story about a Norman. I mean, another funny story about a Norman Wexler. For months, I pumped him full of the drug. I had to see how much the body could take before death. It would certainly appear suspicious if residents and tourists started dying without explanation. But as it turned out, in this respect, the drug is safe. The safe, the same cannot be said for mental instability. Wexler became very aggressive, so much that he decided to stop the experiments. I mean, so, so much that I decided to stop the experiments. But after a while, I accidentally found out that he had lost his family and the police are looking for him. I'll bet anything that Wexler's new found insanity is connected to the drug. Is that my name? Norman Wexler? <laughs> Later, after a car accident, he ended up again in Alcamilla, and it looks like he's got some partial memory loss. I don't envy this idiot, but I've given him fair compensation for the experiment and warned him of all the risks involved. Oh my god. I am Norman Wexler. I know. I was just scared. Afraid to face the truth. I tried to erase it from my memories, but it kept coming back and back and back again. It's all my fault. It has nothing to do with Dr. Kaufman. I was taking the drugs because... Because I wanted it for myself. And I killed my family over it. I killed them. All this time I've been searching for Kaufman. But I've just been looking for the truth. And when I found it, I... I just... My truth. My personal hell. Damn, you murdered your own family over this? Drug. Damn. That's that's messed up, dude. Oh, great. Hey, great. Now we're now we're in teleportation mode, just like off of Silent Hill 2. Ugh. Oh, I don't like the squishiness of the brain. Luckily, I got a strong stomach, but I don't like the squishy sounds though. Door doesn't have a handle. Oh, I remember the we're on the first floor. Oh, we're in nowhere land now because now this is the apartment. Left hand is missing. Right hand is missing for the mannequin. There we go. The 
opposite. Okay, so let's write that down. The opposite of this photo. So. So if there's a closed, open, close, close, open, close, open, close. All right, so the opposite should be, uh, Hold on, let me write, let me draw this out. Open, close, open, open, close, open, close, open. All right, got it. Lock is broken. Door stuck. I need a key to, to the box. All right. The baby was crying last time I was in the apartments, but now the baby's all happy. That's weird. I guess the baby's happy that I'm finally seeing the truth. That I'm a dang murderer and a drug user. Great. Oh, I hear that woman noise in the background. Here we are. Alrighty. I wouldn't touch this even with gloves on. Yeah, it's a front of brain, dude. What do you expect us to be in? Of course the phone's not gonna work because the phone's connected to a brain. All right, let me save my game. Am I really a murderer? Yes, you are. How do you not realize that after everything that's been revealed? <sighs> All right. Um, you know what? I'm going to end my video here. If you like this video, please give this video a like. Comment on this video on how you game so far. Subscribe to me if you see more game videos like these. All right. This has been Gamer. Peace out. And I'll definitely see you on the next episode of Alcamilla, which will do this... Um, opposite puzzle involving the morgue doors. Alright, bye everyone.